So I've been looking for a good neon sign generator and uh, it has been quite difficult to get one that I'm satisfied with until I found this geosign generator. You know, I, I like making cities a lot and one thing I struggled with is uh, adding uh, signs and uh, things like that. You can see here, uh, the city deserved more life with it, with uh, neon signs and everything, but uh, the only thing I managed to do is add this text here uh, because I, I couldn't create neon signs uh, quite easily. Uh, that's why I just settled for a city without uh, neons just like this. But uh, yeah, this add-on here uh, is uh, very, very powerful. You can see some of the renders here. It's it can it has a lot of features is procedural and uh, can generate quite a lot of different variations of neon signs and uh, the signs are also animated as you can see here you can also create these uh, large led screens i'm going to show you the installation process and how you can use it here and uh, how much control this add-on gives you i can use text you can use uh, curves uh, basically anything you can think of you can use yes the installation process is uh, quite simple you just go to edit preferences and then install locate where you have downloaded the add-on geosigns install and I just uh, activate it it's going to be in your end panel here it's called geosign and you can see how it looks so to use it you just have to go to your main library here main asset library hit import so just allow the execution if you want to use text all you have to do is uh, add a text object uh, write a few texts you want so I can say like uh, duplicate this uh, let me say sub i duplicate that hello world yay now to use these all you have to do is uh, select one by one and hit the select tool and you should see it being added to a text assets uh, collection there and then add hello world and then add yay uh, so now that uh, everything is in, in that we can just come in here and select use assets and now you can see now we have that in here and all the materials are already set up for for us i can increase the brightness of this i'm just going to go under the panel you have a lot of buttons to customize your sign so uh, to make it much easier to access uh, they are all collapsed into a panel list here so i'm going to go to my uh, material source settings and just scroll under uh, the materials and uh, this neon sign uh, the first material here is uh, the material for the text itself so i'm going to come here and just increase the glow and uh, increase the strength uh, to something like 10 so that is more uh brighter now let me see this in in uh, ev here uh, just make sure that uh, i turn on the ambient occlusion and bloom so that we can see the full effect so you can see i can even control the color quite easily like that so since we already set up the text uh, we remember we set up about four different versions of the text so i can come here and change the random seed it will choose from the list of texts we created i can click on uh, uh, like a random seed again and you can see every text i want is there so uh, you're not only limited to the text you write yourself if you don't want to write anything i uh, can go to the sign text library and uh, you can see a list of different uh, texts you want to use so i can use import assets and uh, that should be added into my library and you can see the sign already changes to a different type of text and i can also randomize uh, the text uh, to something different remember you still have control over the materials so you can change them uh, to whatever you want and at any uh, moment you can even expose all the panels so you can go through uh, them uh, differently again this is the seed control uh, to get the different seed so if i duplicate this i can change the seed so that this is a different sign from this and uh, the great thing about this is that i can even change the direction so this becomes a vertical sign uh, so you're not only limited to text you can also use curves so for example i can come here and uh, go to draw curve uh, try to sign you just draw whatever curve you want and then you can go back to your neon sign and uh, go to the panels and select source settings uh, to select what source you want to use and now just disable the object and then turn to curve select uh, to curve mesh and uh, now you can select the curve you want click uh, the curve again and now you can see our sign there i can come in scroll down and uh, go to my sign control uh, to ch change the sign body size body or sign body i uh, change the rectangular size uh, the the board or i can change the back back plate type if i don't want uh, the back yeah there is a cable length uh, seed uh, variations 
basically uh, the density if you don't want that many so if you have a city like like i do here again all you have to do let's say we want a neon uh, sign here you just have to snap your cursor at any point you want come in here let's go to the main asset and just import the asset i'm going to rotate it on the x here even the back side of this looks really good so yeah that's a nice detail so i can leave that there and just make a copy and put it on this building here so i'm just going to the go to source control uh, material source settings uh, increase the brightness of this light and to somewhere there i want a vertical sign at uh, this time there may be a different material so if I want to make sure that this is a, a separate material, all I have to do is just click on this number here so that it's only that object, this neon sign that changes. And I can change the direction of uh, the sign. So let me go back to all panels and uh, change the direction so that this is a vertical sign like that. And also, let me change the seed so that this is a different sign. So yeah, that's neon sign for you. You can see how powerful it is. And uh, just look at some of the renders. Uh, the sign itself is quite detailed. They have a nice documentation for the add-on in case you are confused by anything. And uh, they're running a discount right now, a 30% discount if you get it right now. So yeah, check it out. Links are going to be in the description. Thank you for watching.